here with Jared Davis of the, uh, I wanted to say Rochester Nighthawks, but uh, Brampton Excelsiors. Uh, Jared, a huge goal. You guys are up six to five on the Joe Walters goal. You come right back. Joey gets an assist on it, and you put your team up seven five. Um, for yourself, how gratifying was it to, uh, to score in the, that stage of the game? Yeah, you know, it's always nice to score at any time of the game, but at that particular time, it was a pretty crucial goal, and luckily I had a great pass from Joe. He uh, fed it in there pretty nice, and I just put it back past uh, Goodbeak there. Now, I noticed a uh, lot you, uh, you play short, short team. Um, it seemed like you and Joe were getting a lot more floor time in that uh, in that third period. Was that something that the coach had a lot of confidence in you, or is that how you generally uh, see your shifts during a game? I think it had a little bit of both. You know, it's nice that the coaches uh, had some confidence in us, but when it's four on four, three on three, the floor opens up a little more, and me and Joe can use our speed, and I think that's one of the reasons why we got up. How does the series shape up now with uh, the series tied 1-1? You know, game three, everyone says it's the most important game of the series, so uh, we're not going to look past that. We play Wednesday night in Peter Road, it's a tough place to play, so hopefully you come up with a win and uh, an effort similar to tonight. Do you think uh, getting this playoff experience is going to help you uh, down the road for the Nighthawks? Oh, absolutely. You know, these guys, they're all over the, the league. I don't think there's maybe there may be two guys who aren't playing in the NLL right now. So getting this experience, uh, going late in the playoffs, this is the reason why I came out to Brampton this year, and I'm really happy about it. All right.